She methodically drowns her three children one by one by one. Then she gets off the hook claiming mental defect that she's mentally ill. But she's not so mentally ill that Latrice Brewer doesn't have the wherewithal to sue for her cut of the estate. To Noam Layden joining me, news anchor WABC. Noam, thanks for being with us. The uh, nearly a half a million dollars that came from a lawsuit against defects, right? Against child protective services. That's right. The uh, two fathers of uh, the, there were three kids: the six-year-old, the five-year-old, the eighteen-month-old. And the two dads went into court and said, hey, you know, Child Protective Services didn't protect our kids. We told them the mother was crazy. And so the, uh, they, they, the child service agency settled for $350,000. And uh, that's the money that Leatrice is going after. You know, it's amazing to me. With me is Noam Layden, uh, news anchor WABC. Noam, that she methodically kills them. And the reason I keep using the word methodically, Noam, is because under the law, premeditation means that you have time to plan. That's all it means. However, also under the law, premeditation can be formed in the blink of an eye, in a twink, twinkling, just like that, in a snap. The time it takes for you to raise the gun and pull the trigger is long enough under the law for premeditation to be formed. She had the time to slit the six-year-old's throat, to drown all three of them, to lay them side by side in the bed. She had plenty of time to think about what she was doing. Under the law, that's premeditation. To Clark Goldband, now after the dads win the lawsuit against Child Protective Services, Leatrice Brewer is suing for nearly half a million dollars. How is this happening? Well, Nancy, her attorney says she's entitled to a cut of the money because she's the mom of the children. And there it seems to be a little bit of a loophole that is being cited here. The son of Sam Laws. We're Did you all say a with... little bit of a loophole? A little bit of a loophole? Okay, let's you call it a loophole. You can't kill all loophole. three of your children. You can then get nearly half a million dollars for it? Is that, that's a little loophole to you? Well, I guess you're right, Nancy. A loophole is a loophole. And here's the thing. Since she pled uh, mentally incompetent to stay on trial and is in a psychiatric facility, she was never found guilty. And under Son of Sam laws, if you're found guilty of murder, you cannot profit. Hence, she seems to be entitled to the money, according to her attorney. And I just want to point out one more thing here, Nancy, which you just alluded to about these three kids. The six-year-old was killed first. The oldest child was killed first and slashed in the throat multiple times.